Tommy Cedarlin is used to getting up at dawn. Are you all right? Yeah. Yeah. Good. It's just early. As a pilot, he double checks every line, walks every inch of the fabric. Uh, the balloon is 180,000 cubic feet which is equal to, to the volume of 30 school buses. And make sure the temperature is just right. Before we can take off, have to heat excessively in the balloon, so it's gonna be a little hot on your head. By the time the sun is up, so are we. See ya. This is how balloon rides begin in Colorado. As we leave the ground, Boulder emerges. The scenery like nothing I've seen before. The Indian peaks, glaciers, the flat irons, and Devil's Thumb on the ridge. And off in the distance. Today we can see Pikes Peak 100 miles away. Other than that burner, there is a sense of calm. This is what draws Tommy to his adventures. You can see so far, as long as he can remember. Long time, since 1972. His balloon has taken him all over the world. Flights in Africa and Kenya, Stockholm, of course. But of all the places on the map, this is one of his favorites. Gives you the feeling of being on top of the world. The serenity takes, takes over. Our rides seem to put the morning in slow motion. Like it's not windy, it's not shaky, it's just like smooth ride all across. Like that, we drifted 12 miles away. So we have that shift on top that is taking us towards southeast. And before we knew it, we were ready to land again. This is so cool. Bend your knees, hold on tight. Everybody ready? We're ready. Great landing. To top it off, we celebrate my first time. I'm gonna baptize you. I can't think of a better way to start the day. The oh. balloon mermaid. Ah. The balloon mermaid of the Twin Lakes. <laughs> so there. I like it.